Fox 2 follow up tonight. An arrest has been made for a deadly hit and run that occurred one month ago today on St. Charles Rock Road. Fox 2's Jeff Bernthal reports on that investigation and the nearby city that is now considering speed bumps to make their community safer. A memorial for Marquise Murray is still visible. His daughter, an UMSL student, told us her dad was known for his big heart. Police say that heart was still beating after a hit and run driver struck him near St. Charles Rock Road and Normandy Avenue October 11th. Murray died soon after the crash at an area hospital. It was heartbreaking. It really was. The mayor of nearby Greendale tells us in addition to last month's deadly crash, two Greendale residents have lost their lives in crashes near that same intersection. Oftentimes people who pass you up, cut you off, you catch up with them at the light. They really haven't gained anything. And it's just unfortunate when people get hurt for foolish reasons. Police tell us an arrest was made in this most recent case and that the prosecuting attorney's office is reviewing the evidence. No charges have been filed. We feel for them. We feel for the family. The pastor of a church where the memorial still stands says drivers need to slow down. Don't be the person that will cause somebody to die or somebody to end up at the hospital. We're having a major meeting Tuesday in our community to see if the residents would like speed bumps. The mayor says if all drivers knew the pain victims' families are feeling, they would not be speeding. And for what, to save a few seconds? You know, I'd much rather slow down and save a life than to speed to get somewhere. The board meeting in Greendale is set for November 15th at 630. A vote could be taken. That meeting will be virtual. Jeff Bernthal, Fox 2 News.